Hello, welcome back to Your Turn to Die, the majority vote. Okay, so basically what happened in the last video is all of us kind of got kidnapped and put in here. There was a first trial, which some of us, only some of us had, um, where we had to, you know, use one key to escape, otherwise we both would die. I had like 10 seconds left and then I would have died, so you know, got lucky on that one. Um, then, now we're in this room. This girl passed out because her sister actually died. And these guys are watching her. And we are with So. Any exits out of this room? I did accidentally click on one of these already before recording. Um, they do have, they have like cushions at the end and that's where we fell into. So I'm assuming, one, two, three, I'm assuming all these doors have like the cushions. But, I'm assuming all of them do, I guess. Am I supposed to... What am I supposed to do? <laughs> We're supposed to split up and stuff, but this is the only exit. Okay, I have zero yen. What do we need yen for? Oh, I can just move to the question marks. Okay. There's a green vending machine here. Seems to sell drinks, but I've got no money. Shocker. Vending machine with high prices. Water and soda. Oh, that's why I need yen. Both cost a thousand yen. Talk about price gouging. It's like, what, like ten dollars? That, yeah, that's kind of expensive. Not in the US, but no, I'm just kidding. Okay, let's go to the bar. This looks like a bar. Seems to be a lot of alcohol present, but you're underage, so keep away, Miss Sarah. You'd better not drink at a time like this either, so. On the other hand, some might say there's no better time to drink. I. So this guy's. I'm sorry, the kid in this guy? <laughs> okay, I'm on the menu. And drink. Alice, Kai, Kazumi. Kaiji, Kaiji, Shinsuke, Sao, Naomichi, so that's just a nickname, Alice, Mai, Megumi, Reko, Katoro, Can't Drink, um, uh, so all the younger kids, our names and some strangers names too, don't tell me the people who we haven't seen here are Come on. Huh. The sliding door. I was clicking on the school, but that's, that's cool. Open it. Let's open it, I guess. Ooh, uh, yeah? Won't open. I'm too weak, I really doubt I can open this. <laughs> what are you so yeah, bro? We'll have Kataro do it. Oh, Miss Sarah. Have you encountered many dangers? Please take up most caution, yes. Ours are just full of alcohol, meow. I hate alcohol, Bluff, and I hate my drunker dad more. <laughs> I'm sorry. Your dad has a bad drinking habit? He's an annoyance, Bluff. When you drink, you gotta be sure not to get swallowed up yourself. I'm drinking H2, I ought to be careful. Yeah. Um, okay, well. Let's go back to the central hall. See if we can find Katara. Let's go to this. Lots of question marks. 
There's a red vending machine here. Seems to sell cigarettes, and in the back is a smoking area, I guess? Don't buy any if you're underage, of course. Can't go turning into you into a delinquent, Miss Sarah. Even lots of delinquents don't smoke, honestly. Yeah, um, okay. It's got a high class feel, huh? Okay, so I have a cigar. And then game room. Let's go to a game room. Can't go light up a cigar, no. <laughs> Is this a game room? Pretty lonesome considering. Feels like there'd be some kind of puzzle or trick to this place. I'll rely on your insight, Miss Sarah. It's a dartboard. How dreary, playing here would just feel lonely. What's that thing above the dartboard? Seems to be a breeze blowing. Huh. Yeah, okay. The red door? Shut fast. How curious. And a blue door. Seems we can enter any time. Okay, let's go to the blue room. Okay. Whoa, what are those? There are human-shaped figures sitting in the chairs. Let's get closer and check them out. I want to check out this guy. Looks like it's a doll. A doll, huh? Let's inspect it. Let's take it off the chair and inspect it. Huh? The doll's attached to the chair. Feels like there's something to this. Well, that's good anyway. I don't know what I'd do if it's suddenly attacked. Bro. <laughs> hmm? Taking a closer look, there's something between the doll and the chair. Is this a gun? <laughs> this kills up. No, 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 no. What are you gonna do with that, Sarah? Huh? Ah, oh, sorry, Miss Sarah. Hey, would you give me that? Uh, no. Uh -huh, that's right, you shouldn't let it leave your sight. It doesn't seem to have bullets, but definitely don't hand it over to someone else. I understand. Okay, there's a guy smoking a cigar. Interesting. There's this guy. I think he's my stalker. <laughs> I don't know. Because <laughs> last video we were saying how he looks familiar. What if he's the stalker? That'd be creepy. But up here this is a doll. Its placement here seems- oh sorry. Its placement here seems significant. The head has a wavy feel. When I shake it, I hear this sloshing sound. Is there liquid inside? Perhaps the kidnapper's aim is to have us pick a straw in here for hydration. When- we find ourselves thirsty. The head seems solidly built, though. Apologies, I was trying to tell a joke. <laughs> At a time like this? Truly sorry. Yeah, I don't think... We'll search diligently. The dubious doll sits in the chair. We can't inspect it. Hey Sarah, put out your hand. Hmm? Oh, wait, these are... No, they're not mine. Found them while checking the seats. I've never seen these in real life. Are these real bullets? Probably dangerous stuff, so would you take them? Why me? Joel will get antsy if I have them. That said, I can't give them to Joe either. <laughs> I'm counting on you, Sarah. Okay, well... Joe. I wonder what this big painting is for. Finding it curious. Yeah. Maybe try taking it off the wall. I think I'll check the easy things first, like these stairs. Besides, Sarah, it, it's just barely out of your reach, huh? Hey, I grew a centimeter since last year. Don't take me lightly. Oh, sorry. Don't, don't put me down, man. I'll be calling you Shorty someday. <laughs> Sure is a suspicious place, I tell you what. What are you doing, Kitaro? 
I'm just getting a big old view of the room. But these guys are checking every corner, no hesitation. Aren't they scared of traps? Well, now it doesn't seem there's security cameras. Okay. Well, let's move out of here. Oh, what? Should we go in the red room? Get a safe. What a safe. Thank you. Okay. Okay, well, let's try to go on in this red room. Okay, never mind. I don't know why I saved it. Deep hole here. Yike, that's deep, alright. Seems like there's wind blowing. Our kidnappers are telling us to eat up here. Well, let's take this dart. It's small, but it looks fancy. The tip is sharp, so be careful. And a lighter. Obtain a lighter. An expensive looking zippo lighter. Okay. I can see the kitchen through the glass. What an imposing atmosphere. That red lamp is eerie. Don't think I have the courage to enter that door. Um. Whoa, it's not locked. What should we do, Miss Sarah? Are we going in? No, 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 no. Okay. I want to go. Before we do that. Before we do that stuff, I think. I'm going to go to the game. Congratulations, congratulations, and fantastic bullseye. For hitting the bullseye, you get a wonderful gift. Please look into the hole. Exercising caution as I looked into the hole around the dartboard, I saw something within reach. Obtained a left leg. Ugh, that's the worst. Huh? Oh, looking closer, it's a doll leg, huh? How mean to pull the same trick over and over. I'll hold on to this. Oh, I thought this was like a counter, but it's literally like a hole. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I was like, what hole are you talking about? Okay. Let's go. Yeah. Huh. Oh, there's a body. No, <laughs> um... <laughs> um, excuse me? It's obviously this. You remember the that note Kaiji read? Find the body, right? There was a note in there. I wonder if the doll head from the box can be combined with this torso. Will that make something happen? It might, which is a little scary. Yeah, yeah, right. Let's search around some more first. <laughs> I can put this off for now, right? No. Why? Oh. Hey, let me look at those. 
Ah, uh, these are dummy bullets. Dummies? They're like toys. If you put these in the gun, they won't fire. So they're not real bullets. Yeah, they're safe at any rate. I know. Let's have KG look at these. He should have more expertise than us, so maybe he can tell us something. Yeah. No, I want to take it. Uh... Dummy bullets and bullets. Okay. What's especially strange to me is how there were a gun and bullets in this room. What meaning could there be to give the cam blah blah blah? Might want to cause discord. Discord? A weapon that puts one person at an advantage. Who'd want to hand that over to someone else? A fight over the weapon? Yeah, that's plausible. But we've got good old Sarah with us, so we won't fall for that trap. Why do you trust me so much? Only because you're so darn cute. Um, yeah. Can we pull this down? Okay, but damn it, it's a trap. Who knows what will happen? Stay alert. Hey now, don't put yourself so on guard. But whose voice was that? Ha ha ha, don't sweat the details. I'm the master at this room. You can call me Meister. Now, to get right to it, let me explain the rules of the next game. The, the rules? Well, of course, you want to stake your life without even knowing the rules? You're a real character, ma'am. Stake my life. Oh, he's talking from the painting. This one's simple. Right now, there's you five humans in this room, right? Glance around the room. There's four open seats. One will be the challenger, and the other four will get to sit down and be targets. Targets? Targets for what? Well, I gave you that cool weapon here in this room, didn't I? Well, you're gonna be targets for a revolver? And what are the rules to this? Surely there's an outcome where nobody dies. <laughs> Naturally. A regular death trap is just old hat, get me? To see, first you'll have to decide who'll be the challenger for me. You're telling us to decide who's gonna shoot without knowing what the game is? Who's gonna wanna be the targets? Will the challenger be safe? Yep, only the targets get to relish the thrill. What a shame. 
I see. Sir, can I ask you to be the challenger? What? D don't kid me. You, you can't take that all on your own. I suppose it may not be proper to make a young girl handle the gun. I'm in favor of it myself. Sarah's got a clear head. Well, Sarah, are you confident? Yes. I got y'all. I got you, you boys. Joe, in that trial he did what I counted on him to do. Now he's making a request of me. I'll handle this, definitely. Please, let me do it. No way, you can't approve of that. It's not like I don't trust you, don't think badly of me. Holding it to a vote. Perhaps that is the best way to settle this. Why don't we discuss it, then hold a majority vote? Yeah, might be the only way. Right. Gotcha, let's do it. Talk to me when you're all set, I'll be standing right here. Yes. Always on your side. I, I got it. I don't know what I'm doing, but I got it. Okay. So this is important. So there's only a few of us in this room. Once we settled our opinions, we'll hold a vote at the end. Sarah, you know what's up. Show Katara what makes you worth trusting. Okay. We gotta have the one we can trust must be the challenger, I'm thinking. Yeah. No objections there, right? So let's talk this out. Straight to the point, I've got experience handling guns, so leave being the challenger to me. Is that true? Yep, I hate lies. I got real acquainted with shooting when I went to the US. So you're saying you've had training. I'll keep it simple too. Hey Toro, even if you had experience, I can't trust you. Really now? Sorry. The mood has become tense. Hmm, I am undecided. It pains me to put the responsibility on Miss Sarah. Cause, so he's worried about my thing. He's worried that I'm a girl and I can't shoot. <laughs> I shot that dart like crazy, dude. I think I'll be good. She'll be fine. Sarah's got a mind to steal. Just call her Steel Mine. <laughs> Yeah. Call me Steel Mine, that's my nickname. <laughs> well, Sarah, can you think of any rebuttals? There isn't a lot I can say myself, is there? I'll think about it. Ask me if you're not sure. We'll stress about it together. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna save. Because, <laughs> my god, okay. Um. Not a lot of people in this country who handle guns. My experience is valuable, ain't it? We don't know what the game entails, but if it requires skills with guns, then yes. Right, I ain't thinking a single thought about keeping my own hide safe. I'm just considering the best way to beat this game. I, I do get what you're saying, but you guys gotta think about it rationally. It's not like we're not thinking either, okay? Okay. How about you? So it's a question of who I would want to do so. Of course there is someone here who would be well suited to such a task, but for some reason he is not presenting himself as a candidate. This guy. Yeah. Whatever the case, if he refuses it, I have no desire to ask him. How troubling. You don't have enough time, time to build trust, that is. Precisely. And yet it appears you are very trusting, Miss Sarah. Oh, you can tell. I may offer my interpretation. Perhaps it's because Sarah and Joe are acquainted. Because those two can vouch for each other. You concluded they could be trusted, yes? Do I look that calculating? That comes as a real shock. No, it just looks so easy. <laughs> it's just intuition. I'm confident in the eye for people. I see. 
However, there is a piece missing from your story. Oh yeah? What's that piece? So... I don't even think I am. The godfather of the son of Beno High School. You know what, you're right with him. Yeah, true, thinking about it logically, you don't have much to understand though, Sarah. In that case, how about you have two people's statements duke it out? Yeah, pit opposing statements against each other to advance the discussion. So you're saying to borrow the words of others? I'll give it a try. Okay. Okay, well, I'll try. So... Straight to the land that I experienced so you've been. Okay. So you're the one we have to convince. <laughs> okay. I think we pit these two guys against each other. Kitaro, even if you do have experience, I can't trust you. Er, why is that? Is experience important for this? Because I can't imagine this game requires skill with a gun. Say what? Look at the room. Aren't these dolls curious? Embedding their dummy targets. Dummies? Shoot a human or shoot a doll. That's probably what the game's about. What's important is a cool head. Targets can't move from the chairs anyhow. I'm always cool-headed, believe it or not. Even when you're pointing a gun at someone. It's an awful thing when the person you're looking at could die by your hand. You ever experienced that? I trust somebody determined to save her friend more than the amateur with average training. I get it. Maybe I might not be up for it. But still, I've got more to say. Suppose I'll listen. Progress. <laughs> Kaiji, doesn't that mean we should have you be the challenger? You must have been in a ton of gunfights in your line of work. But that is true. Indeed, I was wondering about that myself. Why the policeman who would be most suitable is not recommending himself? Guess he would think so, huh? If I'm gonna put my life on the line, I want the most dependable person I can get. If it ain't me, then it's Kaiji. You're the only one. Kaiji, what's the matter? We won't know if you keep quiet. If you refuse, I wish to know the reason. At this rate, it will prove an issue. We cannot end our discussion in this state. Okay, what was that? At this rate, our discussion can't advance. And that happens talking to people so you can extract new statements to work. Your clingy questioning might just lead to <laughs> important statement, thank you. Am I that clingy? I, I'm joking, you know that, right? I was joking too, it's fun to see him flustered. Oh, don't grin at me. Okay, well, let's, let's extract some information. Have you never fired again? Hey G, have you never actually fired a gun? I have. Um, okay, well... Why make me do it? Cause you're so darn cute. How many times are you gonna make me say it? Okay, let's well, let's, let's talk to this guy. 
Under normal circumstances, I would never impress someone this deeply, but our lives are on the line. So even Kai can't remain alone forever. Hey, she doesn't mean that it should be the way of you. I think Claire handles guns and full cool headed most suitable. He might be right if we were to ask someone else. I'd probably ask KG. Okay, well, I guess we still gotta extract friends. Why are you silent? KG? Answer me! Whoa. We're all being serious. If you don't say what you're thinking, we won't know. <laughs> what are you, my mom? <laughs> Ooh, ah, that was a good laugh. All right, I'll explain. I shot a person. Since then, I haven't been able to fire a gun. Huh? I know it's pathetic. Should have been prepared. Should have been prepared for that when I became a detective. But if something like that happened, wouldn't it make the news? Reality is not only what comes to the surface. That's all you got, it's the truth. Doubt will tell me anymore. But it seems I've extracted a new statement out of KG. Okay, so I gotta do... The Is that the truth? Yeah. On the job, right? Did you did you shoot? Did the one you shoot die? Traumatic, I bet. Real sorry I can't live up to your expectations. Ever since then, pointing a gun at somebody makes my head go weird. Can't stop sweating. What I want to make you do it then. So, so you'll count on Sarah, right, Katoro? Hold on now, I'm still uneasy. It's our life's what's on the line, right? Huh? Kataro? I managed to convince him this much with everyone else's words. Sarah, in the end, I, I have to persuade Kataro myself. Okay. War of words. A war of words will begin with Kataro. Kataro's statements will appear in speech bubbles. By touching statements that you can refute, will do damage to Kataro. Choose the statements that seem like they'd inflict the most damage, then defeat Kataro. Um. Okay. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Understood. Progress. Oh, he's so handsome. Can a high school kid handle this? Can I retry that? Oh. Nice. Okay, I did get it. Well, seems it's decided. There'd be no objections, right? Ha ha ha, naturally. Sarah, 
Ain't hardly any kids these days who can make them themselves as clear as you. I feel like I can bet on ya. Kataro. What a cool thing to say. <laughs> Man, looking at you guys just makes me feel like I'm being selfish. Alright, good luck with the rest, Sarah. It's all riding on you. Right, leave it to me. Well then, shall we take our seats? Okay, so... There's three... Third one's there. There's one, two... I'm gonna take a picture of this, cause... <laughs> I think I know what's happening, <laughs> but I don't want to mess up. I know, forget. Okay. Things are just about to get started. Okay, once I prepared myself, I'll talk to the man in the painting. Dummy bullets are pulling Okay, I'm ready. No, that took forever. Is it okay for me to give the rolls now? Yeah, please. Yeah. You should have also found dummy bullets in a different room. You got three live bullets and six dummies. A total of nine bullets you can load into this revolver. You gotta follow. Fire all nine bullets into everyone, human and doll, in any order you like. Also, the bullets are all fired in a clockwise order. Oh god. Oh god. Let me think about this. So, oh God, okay. Um, how do I know which one for sure, though? God. Okay, um, so my first thought was put them all in, like, dummy, 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 whatever, right? And then three live bullets, but that would not, because then it could start here and it'd be dummy, that'd be dummy, that'd be a dummy. So that's the issue. So if I put these in a pattern that is distinguishable, that's where I'm getting stuck. How do I know? Because I can't shoot as somebody first because I don't know where it will be. Okay. So... So if I put it in just a straight up pattern, But how will I go about this? Okay. Oh god, this is stressful, okay. If I shoot a dummy first, and it's live, then I know, and then I 
next two, and that would be the best. But if it's if it's a, if it's a dummy and I shoot a doll, if it's a dummy, then that would be I'd have to shoot a doll again. Okay, let's do this. I think so. I think. Okay. All right. Lock in the barrel. Let the barrel spin. It stopped. Now fire in any order you want. So of course, shooting the same target twice or discussing with targets is against the rules. Oh, I can't shoot the same one twice. Okay. Okay, so wait, so there's six dummy bullets. If I shoot two dummy bullets, if it happens to be that way, I'll still have four. So that'll be fine. Okay. Okay, well, here goes nothing. Yes. Unharmed. So that was a dummy one. So I have to shoot again. Yes. Okay. So now it's a live bullet. Yes. Okay. So now it's two dummy bullets. <laughs> I don't like doing it though. Okay. Yes, okay. <laughs> My heart was about to explode in mine too, Jesus Christ. Joe survived. Okay, let's shoot you now. Shoot Kanye. Bravo. Kai survived, okay. Now let's shoot this one because it's a live bullet. head flew off. Okay. Now we can shoot these two, okay? So, yeah. Oh, <laughs> wait! Okay, I'm thinking correctly, I think. And, uh, now we'll be okay. Guitar will survive. Okay, and then we shoot you. Kaiji? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Killing them! Kaji survived, and now we just shoot the doll, right? Doll's head flew off. Oh. Oh. Oh! Fantastic, now that's a job well done. <laughs> no complaints here, you win. Seems like a puzzle like this was a piece of cake for you. Not really. That was stressful, dude. I don't know how I feel. <laughs> I was gonna cry. That's fine though, yeah, no. I mean, I'm great. <laughs> I know I'm good. You deserve a hand. Hey. Ah! <laughs> Be glad and accept it. See ya. Arr. Sarah, well done. Thanks. I changed my mind on you. Honestly, I regret making light of you. This Sarah, that arm. It's artificial. What a cruel trick. It came falling from down from above. Find my body, wasn't it? Ah, seems relevant to that note with the doll's head. So, it'd be a good idea to take this long. Guess we got all carry it in this box. Put it in the box. Okay, we've got a clue of sorts. Let's get out of here. So never came back, did he? I uh, wonder where he went. Did we lose him? Oh well, I guess. Sarah, you were with so, right? It's dangerous to be alone, so I'll search together with you. Thank you. You know what? I, I need a friend right now. <laughs> wow, honest for once. I'm always honest. Well, we'll be heading out. Uh, hold on, you got a second? He left. 
Mr. Hmm? Earlier, I neglected to thank you. Allow me to state my gratitude for taking on such an important role. Thank you very much for saving us amid this great pressure. Miss Sarah, you are no average high schooler. KG noted that you were clear-headed, but what's truly superb is your heart. Indeed, you have a mind of steel. However, overdoing it brings harm to yourself. You must not shoulder too much. Right. I'm gonna think of it, Kai. Why did you... Kai? Uh. Miss Sarah? Uh-oh. Something the matter? I bet he's my stalker, dude. Why now? Why did I only just notice? Why did I remember? Kai is... Kai is... A stalker. You look unwell. Uh, uh, I'm fine. I can hardly get any words out. I can't let him suspect me. I can't let him realize. Just who is this person? Miss Sarah. Sarah, are you okay? Joe. It's okay, I just feel a little drained. Don't push it. Lean on my shoulder and we'll rest. Let's walk. I think I'll calm down if we walk. Got it. Okay. Whew. I'm okay now. For real? Really. In exchange, I, if I say any complaints, you'd better come help me right away. So you're energetic enough to order people around. Fine, complain anytime. I can't tell Joe yet. Yeah, I knew that was our stalker. Okay, let's... Okay. Let's go back to the hall. The place. Maybe... Sarah? Canna! Hey, is it okay for you to be up? I... I... What's the matter? You wanna say something? I just really wanted to ask you about my sister. Please give me an answer. Back then, could Kana have actually saved her sister? I was disoriented, so I didn't hear what everyone else said. But you and Joe and Mishima and now you all had the same trial, right? Kana... Could Kana have saved her? You couldn't have? I don't think... I was about to lie, hoping to relieve her one. Oh my, Miss Kana, Reko and now we're looking for you, you know? Uh, I heard you talking here, so I came over. Mr. Mishima, please tell me, I... You were unlucky, Miss Kana. Eh? Because we only had one key, we... We had to remove the other restraints by force. Luckily, Miss Now had myself, and Miss Sarah had Joe. Yeah. Due to our having a strong man, we barely managed to survive. Excuse me? N no that's a lie, it can't be... It, it's not a lie, it's the truth, Kana. I suppose it was a trial of both assessing the situation and of might. For you and your sister was a trial with hardly any chance of success. I I don't believe it, I won't. You're all trying to deceive me. It's true, Kana. S Sarah, e even if it sounds like a lie, it won't change the reality. We're all telling you the truth. Miss Kana, you regret it, yes? I, Kana, killed her sister. Her sister was frantically trying to help, but Kana's an idiot. She didn't listen. What was your sister like? Sister? My sister was kind. You know, when we fought, she'd never be cruel. She was always thinking about Kana. Why didn't she use the key for herself? Was it not that your very existence gave your sister happiness? Miss Kenna, I can sense you were loved as if it were in the very air. Surely, surely you were raised with the utmost care, were you not? 
I'm sure she was a wonderful sister. Uh, uh, Miss Sarah, if you were her sister, what would you say to her? I was her. encourage her. Kenna, you being there, let me be strong even in hard times. I'm sure even if we were apart, I'll be there somewhere in your heart, so don't give in. Sister? I miss you, sister. Now the time for blaming yourself has passed. Your sister is surely watching you from somewhere. Kenna. Kenna won't give in because her sister is watching. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Kenna! Reko. Give me a unite, Professor. What happened to Shout when you find her? Oh dear, it appears I am being yelled at. That's not it, Reko. See, um, let's go and I'll explain, okay? Hmm, mm, really? Sure, okay. I will return to searching myself. Professor Mishima. Thank you. No, I am thankful to you. It's thanks to you two following along that I was able to make something of it. No, I couldn't do a thing. Miss Sarah, do you understand why Miss Kana came to talk to you? Eh? Surely because you resemble her sister, this is why she wanted to hear it from you. I do? Miss Sarah, until we can leave here, please take the role of Miss Kana's big sister for her. And Joe, her younger brother. Come on, not the elder brother. <laughs> well, then another time. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I can. I'll take her on as my own. I have a scar still. Yeah, let's go here. strong. <laughs> okay, what's in here? Maybe there's some clue in there? Joe stuck his hand into the darkness. Hmm, what's this? Cigar cutter. I think I saw this online once. It's a tool for cutting cigars to smoke. Why were you looking that up online? Don't smoke, Sarah. Can I look like I would? Oh, more importantly, there's something bigger in the back. Alright, what's this? Right way. Nice. Uh, looks like this one's a doll limb too. Take it, Joe. Ooh, why are you so calm? Because it's a doll, Joe. A doll. Okay. Maybe Joe will let me take the doll for some. Let's go back to the cafeteria. Okay. You going, Sarah? Yes. Open her up. Okay. Why? Okay. Okay, well, I think this is gonna do it for this part. Um, if you liked to do all that 
Yeah, sorry, if you like that video, do all that nonsense and stuff, um, greatly appreciate it. And, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Also, let me know if you enjoyed this series. And I'm gonna get one comment saying they do. <laughs> yeah, um, I'll see you next time. Okay, bye-bye.